Rather get to work. Rather get to work. What comes first? First, you have to assemble a crew. Then, there's the Redanian patrols to call a bit. Too many wandering round. We could get noticed. Break-in artists. Tell me about them. Assuming lack of vertigo to be the first requirement. Precisely why my favorite's Eveline Gallo. A circus artist, not better as <coughs> Just now performing with a troupe somewhere near Oxford. Their specialities. <laughs> Breaking and entering. Not officially, no, but I've compared the route her troops taken with a list of the most audacious thefts in recent years. A perfect match. Highly doubt that's a coincidence. But if she's reluctant, we've another option in Hugo Hoff, alias Beef Patty. A halfling. Think he's fit? Pudgy face doesn't really match my image of a criminal. You'd be surprised. Hugo's notched up more break-ins than you felt monsters. More importantly, two years past, he nicked the gold-plated cop from the roof of the town all in no time. So, yeah. Word has it, he's holed up in Oxenfurt in a house near the Noble Grand Gate. Be careful. He's modest in size, but apparently wicked dangerous. All right, opening the vault. Who do we have? Let's start with the fact that one of them's a dwarf. Casimir Bassi, native of Mahaka. A specialist in controlled explosions. Folks say he could blow Novigrad to the high heavens with but a pinch of salt pita. Both dwarfs should be a sick. The problem is, Casimir apparently hung up his detonators some time ago. He married, sired some littler ones, and settled in the village of Almus. My plane turns down. Any options? Quinto, the North's most f arrest one in Safecracker. Arrest warrants out on him in Kedwin, Illyria, Angrin, and Kavir. Sadly, he got nabbed a few days back <laughs> by one Hans of Sidaris, a prick mercenary. As far as I know, his troops made camp east of Oxenfurt, on the right bank of the Pontar. Hmm. So I'd have to rip one from his cosy home, the other from a cosy cage. Need to think about it. What's this about culling the patrols? Told you, no one dies. Easy. I don't want anyone's death. Just need some folk to be temporarily indisposed. Spit it out. You've got to approach the garrison's cook. Convince him to spite the soldiers' nosh with something to keep some of them bedridden. One in two, let's say. Wouldn't want to raise suspicions. Hmm. Know the formula for a potion that might do the trick. There. See? Brew up a bit of that. Hit the town, find the cook, then convince him to do you a favor. I don't know, cast a spell, toss him some coin. He could also use your fists. All right, I'm off. Got a bit to do. As do I. Get it all done, and we'll meet back here. What then? Then, we'll bug a horse up, down and sideways, all together.
have a look. So long. Hey there. Guts! Ah! Piss off then! Fuck off! You'll not tell me what to do! What? What's going on here? In deep play, Master Casimir sat upon his roof. Claims he'll blow himself to bits. Bought the wench pearls, silks, satins, and how the fuck she repaid me? Made me a heat banger cuckold! Try to talk some sense into him. What if he should grow angered? The wench demanded a canopied bed and got it. Silver tableware, she said. Got that too. Lacking nothing. Not a thing. What the fuck else was I to give her? Doubt he can grow any angrier. Hail military. Our hallowed mother. Keep us from evil. What kind of knob you got? Lightly come to poke my Euphemia, eh? Well, you're late. She's gone. No, I just... Postmaster said the same. Denied it all. Swore on the balls of his gods. And the Egypt I am, I believe the bugger. Three nose, then ran the boot under my nose, then ran off. My granda told it right. Not a bloke out there doesn't want to get between a dwarf wench's trotters. Care to set that torch aside? So we can talk this out, calmly. Calmly? Calmly! Wench tossed me aside, took the winds, and I'm to be calm! The country, she says. Fresh air's what I need, she says. So we came out here. Anything for my bunny! Said instead of sucking air, she sucked off the postmaster in my plowing bed! I can't take it no more! Forget about it. Listen, got a job for you. <coughs> for, forget it! Here I am, bearing my soul! 
and you're going to talk me up about work? You're all the same! We dwarves, we're born to muck about in the mind, <laughs> bend our necks, the human yokes. You didn't get a duck's cock about it, you plodding racists! Come to think of it, doubt you're fit for the job. I'm not fit? What? I'm not fit? What the fuck are you saying I'm not fit for, you cocksucker? I'd need you to blow something up, open, but... And I'm not fit for that! Me! Casimir Bassi, top mine foreman in Mahakam! More like top cuckold in Redania now. Top... <laughs> what? You wait! You car, you rogue, you dickhead! You just wait! Oh, oh you yeah. smashes! Oh. Oh. Ah. Ah. You bruised my bones! Right splintered them! Oh. Oh. Sorry. Would have preferred to talk it out. Thing is, you gave me no choice. Nay, didn't he apologize? I needed something of the sort. Some fella to knock the muck out of my heat. Oh. So, uh... Mm. What is it you wanted? Want you to open a door. Permanently. So it won't close again. I see. And what might you find on the other side of... Big one. A reward. Big one. To be split. Enough for everyone. If it come a week past, I'd have sent you the fuck away. But now, now I've nothing to lose. What's it I'm to do? Out of the herbalist who lives near Oxenfurt. Go there and ask for Yarrow Extract. Learn all you need to know. Clear? As a Mahakaman Highland Stream. See ya! Run, Roach! 